hardware comparison between a Galaxy Note 3 and a Galaxy Note 2. Uh, first thing you notice here is on the screen size, they both obviously sports some pretty large displays. The Note 2 has a 5.5 inch display, while the Note 3 has a 5.7 inch display. Um, both, uh, both have HD displays, but the Note 2 has a 720p, while the Note 3 has a 1080p display on it. Here in the back, you have camera differences as well too. A megapixel camera on the Galaxy Note Note 2 here versus the 13 megapixel camera here on the back of the Galaxy Note 3. The Galaxy Note 2 does 1080p video recording while the Galaxy Note 3 is able to do 1080p and 4K video recording as well. Both run on pretty um, solid processors inside of them. Galaxy Note 2 runs a quad-core processor inside of it. I believe it's the Exynos processor inside of it. While the version here for we're not calling anybody here on the demo unit, which probably isn't going out anyways. The Note 3 has um, in the US is going to have a quad-core processor, but overseas it's going to have it have the uh, Exynos octa-core processor inside of it. Both have the S Pen technology as well too. Both actually, let's go back to the RAM a little bit. Both have um, pretty substantial RAM, two gigabytes of RAM in here on the Note 2, three gigabytes of RAM here on the Note 3. Now, they're both running Android with TouchWiz on it, but it's a bit of a different version. This has uh, Android 2. I'm sorry, Android 4.1.2 and the Note 2, and Android 4.3 in the Note 3. So, kind of get the 3, 2, kind of get the idea there. So, this is running the latest software, and it's one of the only devices available right now that actually is running Android 4.3 outside of a Nexus device. Let's take a look here on the side. Very similar in terms of sort of the idea of design language, but you can see the S3, I mean, excuse me, the Note 3 takes much more towards the S4, sort of the foam trimming around it, and it's a little bit more square with sort of the round and sort of curved the way this is. Uh, the Note 2 is, you can see it has a leather back here versus sort of the plastic back here on the back. The button placement is pretty much exactly the same. Headphone jacks are pretty much the same location as well, too. Not too much has changed there on that. Um, other than that, the two are pretty interesting. It's going to be very, very cool to do a verse between the two of these to see which one is the better one, the Note 2 and the Note 3. I'm leaning towards the Note 3 a little bit there, but um, definitely subscribe to our YouTube page here so make sure you can check out all the latest videos from BW1.com and when we have our review of the Note 3 and the verse between the Note 2 and the Note 3. So for now, this is Bowman from BW1.